your family and this is devastating. This morning my heart was just broken in pieces. The heartbreak at the sheer devastation of that quake being felt around the globe tonight. Here at home, massive efforts are underway to get aid to the affected areas quickly. Casey Cronus has the story. From medical support to donations of food and clothing, volunteers are working around the clock, including here at the Turkish American Cultural Alliance to provide comfort and support to those in the disaster zone. Between sorting, stacking, and taping, Help from Chicago will soon be on its way to Turkey and Syria. For Murat Ergan, it's an effort that hits close to home. I still remember that noise, you know, the rumbling sounds coming and it just shocks you. In 1999, while living in Turkey, he survived the Izmit earthquake. It killed more than 17,000 people. I remember American soldiers coming to our uh, camp and, you know, building those tents. In collaboration with the Turkish Consulate General in Chicago and Turkish Airlines, volunteers with the Alliance are collecting new winter clothing for kids and adults. Tents, blankets, sleeping bags, power banks, hygiene products, baby food, and diapers. May God help them. May they're in, in the prayers, all, all the parents, the children, and everybody. Other groups providing humanitarian aid include the Syrian American Medical Society, or SAMS. More than 2,000 health care providers with the organization are on the ground right now, helping injured children and adults. There is no, uh, no mercy in the force of nature when it happens. So uh, it's us humans who are going to be able to help each other. Donations can be dropped off here at 3845 North Harlem Avenue on weekdays from 4 to 7 p.m. on Saturday from noon to 5 and on Sunday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Reporting in Dunning, Casey Cronus, Fox 32, Chicago.